Today is lesson 12. We're still working on those consonant combinations. We have the digraph sh at the end of a word. The hyphen goes before. We have the ch at the end of a word. That's another digraph, ch. And then we have the blended sound nd. And we have the third spelling of the k sound, ck, after a vowel. A short vowel gets the CK sound, so K is also used. So let's talk about some of these. Some of these are pretty easy peasy when you write them. Fish, there's that digraph. Do you notice here in the orange color, you see the digraph SH, and here it is again, SH. So we have I, SH, and WA, SH, and LUN. There's the digraph CH that says CH. A digraph means two letters together that makes one sound. So this is an important distinction to notice those digraphs, okay? A blend is just two letters together, but you don't hear the sounds quite as clearly. They just go together so quickly. So listen to it. Hand, 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 sand. And some people even drop the D sound in some parts of the country. Hand, sand. Okay, after a short vowel, ah, uh, ah, uh, O says ah, uh, we spell the K sound with a CK. So after the short vowel, we spell the K sound with CK. So here's the short vowel I, and we spell it with the CK. All right, so that's a little information about all of those consonant combinations, the digraphs and the spelling patterns that will help you. So your job now is to carefully write each word and say the letters F-I-S-H, fish, right? So say the letters, say the sounds, and blend them together. Make sure when you're blending, you blend the digraphs together. So when you finish that work, you can unpause your video and check your work. So before you move on, make sure you check that your words are all correct. So we've read them already before. It's always good practice to go back and reread word lists. Fish, wash, lunch, bench, hand, sand, rock, sick. So now our next direction here is to write the words with the same endings in each group below. Okay, so do you see how they're making the endings out of your consonant combinations? You have the digraphs all go here, the digraph for CH, so SH, CH, the ones that end with the combination ND all go here, and the spelling pattern CK all go in this group. So Fish has already been done for you, so all you need to do is trace it. Fish. So now you need to look through the list and see. Do you see any other sounds? Here, look. W, I, sh, wish. So we can write the word. W, I, sh, wish. And cross it off. So continue that to sort all four groups, and then you can unpause your video and check your work. So your work should look like this. Let's go back and reread the words. It's so important to reread your words. Fish, wish, dish. Do they all end in the digraph? Sh. Ends in ch. Lunch, bench, bunch. Ends with the constant combination nd. Hand, band, sand, and ends with the spelling pattern CK. Rock, sock, kick. Excellent job. So if your work looks like mine, you're ready to move on to number three. Number three, write each word below. Use the picture as hints. So the pictures are going to help us remember what these words are. So they've done a couple for you. We have band. So here's a picture 
of people playing musical instruments, and that's a band. And here is a picture of a plate, so that's a dish. A dish can be a bowl or a plate or a serving tray, so a dish. And then here is a picture of a sock. So those are new ones. Everything else you should be able to figure out. Here the child is kicking the soccer ball. Okay, so I want you to challenge yourself. Use all the words we've already used and fill in all of those blanks. So good luck and unpause the video when you're ready to check your answers. All right, let's see how you did. Let's read each of the words. Fish, lunch, sand, sick, kick, dish, band, sock. If you got all those right, you're ready to move on to number four. Complete each phrase using a word from the box below. Use the pictures as hints. So read the words. Fish, rock, lunch, hand. All right, so use the picture. What do you see on dish? Yeah, we see a fish on dish. What do you see on bench? Right, these are not sentences. These are just phrases. Do you see? I think if I have to choose between rock, lunch, and hand, I'm going to choose lunch because this person's eating. So I'm going to say lunch. Lunch. We've got four sounds in that word. Lunch. What's in sand? The hand. Hand in sand. And. And sock on. What's the sock on? It's our last word. Rock. R -a -k. Read the phrases. Fish on dish. Lunch on bench. Hand in sand. Sock on rock. All right, these are looking great. If your work looks like mine and you finished everything, you can give yourself 100 points up there at the tippy top. Nice job, everybody. We'll move on to lesson 13 when you're ready.